bumps the axe. Prove yourself. Brambles off. Faith has the skewer, but that root was not long enough. And now Emo will turn around and deal some harassment back with the alacrity. It looks like the idea was root him up with the brambles and skewer him back to that tier one tower where they could burst him down. But well, Ollie actually will be the first one. So they do get a brambles off. Faith has the skewer, but that root was not long enough. And now Emo will turn around and deal some harassment back with the alacrity. It looks like the idea was root him up with the brambles and skewer him back to that tier one tower where they could burst him down. But well, Ollie actually will be the first one. To you know, Faith has just caught me so much. Nice skewer back. Faith gonna try and go for it, but Emo's got this one. Alacrity is there. He dodged the Sunstrike. Will connect Faith beyond coming in. Still moving forward. Nice skewer back as well. Emo in trouble and will end up falling though. Dogfights was there with the Fisher. At least contribute a little bit once you have a level in Stone Gaze and maybe at least one mid game item. Top lane as well. Yeah. Ego. True right. Yeah, it's not the fastest spell to cast out, but it definitely has quite a long wind up. Mid lane. Mid lane, Faith Beyond. Again, we just saw it. The RP couldn't come out because of the. Seen throughout all the lightning games, right, Mike? They kind of get shafted in the laning phase, but they just catch up. Yeah, they will find dogfights as well, top lane. They turned around for a bit, but they want this Dark Willow mid lane. She does get caught out. Ancient Seal was there, though. Sunstrike will not connect, but they will still have enough. That was bad. <laughs> dogfights. Immediately paying back a bit of a uh, bit of revenge to the way AV home. But now Ego gonna find out Ollie on that Scarath Mage. Should be a very easy pick off though. Mystic Flare does come out. He does a bit worrying for Ehome. They have been playing fairly decent, but we'll see if they can keep it up. And they found the Nyx Assassin again, top lane white. Didn't realize there was a sentry. Pressuring out lane, forcing someone to rotate in, which buy space for Emo, but buy space for your Necrophos as well, who has you know, he's not too far ahead. He needs to play catch up just a fair just a little bit to really stay relevant. Oh doodle. Top lane, they actually long way on E Home and Dog fights, he spots him out. They're gonna be able to take down this Earthshaker, but it feels like they wanted a lot more and now Faith may end up losing his life. The Terrorize does come in. Monkey King Wukong's command, Emo, he's in trouble. He can't get out of this one. They'll find two nice picks. So they lose Faith beyond. Doodle actually still sticking around. I'm not sure about that one. Meanwhile, Oli does get jumped on. Ancient Sue is there. Now Ghost Shroud as well. Reaper's Scythe is available and he will commit it. Ego ends up losing his own life. And Doodle now. If Ego lived through that, definitely worthwhile for e home But he overextended a bit trying to get the chase going. We finally see our first RP coming out with the Stone Gaze and Curse Crown as well. All of this just on this Necrophos. He already used the Ghost Shroud. And so they will take down the Necrophos. At the but the RP is significant. It, it costs you a Roshan as well. Maybe you get this tier one. I'm not sure if even that's a guarantee. Well, they find was there at bot. In fact, mid lane in snare is there onto Ego Doodle going in. Yule Scepter is there as well as the Chaos, but it will miss. And the RP was there from Faith Beyond. They'll get rid of the Aegis though. Wolf Form comes out. Ego has already gone down, and they want to chase Y now on this Nyx Assassin. The Fisher will connect, but kind of blocks his own teammates in. But it doesn't matter. But now it does because they can't get Faith properly. Though Echo committed. Sunstrike is there. Enchant Totem was used. Will they go for the chance? It's on the other side, but you can't quite get the stun out. Oh, ASD. ASD. Yeah, I'm not sure about this one. Faith Beyond does not have the RP either. Though that Stone Gaze does save the day for the moment. ASD does lose over half his mana. And IG, knowing this is down, they may reinitiate here. And ASD continues moving forward. Meanwhile, Ego, though, takes down Emo top lane. And now they're going to engage. Dogfights. Fisher is out, though. He does get impaled. And he's kind of screwed right now. ASD moves forward. Takes him out of the Medusa. He really should have no way out of this. And there's the Fisher from Dogfights. Just to make sure. Sunstrike will actually hurt the Invoker more than it hurts the Nyx Assassin. Thanks to that Spike Carapace. But... Stop here. They keep going. Although the ultimates are up for e -home. that's something to watch out for. It's going to be a bit dangerous going to these two fights. Oh, Echo one. goes in though, dog fights. Faith Beyond, RP is onto two, but he drags one out of that Wukong's command. Dog fights in a bit of an awkward position. He'll back off, but this makes it so Doodle can walk out safely. 
after the Necrophos now. Ghost Shroud is available. Skewer back is there. Curse Crown as well. He doesn't have the Ghost Shroud up, and it looks like they will find him, though. Now they will go in. Ego, Tornado will connect with the Chaos Meteor. Ego's in massive, massive trouble, and he does lose his life. Doesn't have Reaper Sight. Doesn't have any sort of defensive item except for Veil. Doesn't have too much lock on. G, but they are also up for the side of E-Home. Can they find dogfights out? Looks like they will. Skewer back as well. Dogfights actually commits the Echo Slam. They will find Y here, it seems like. Tornado won't find the pick off, but now the concussive shot will. Stone Gaze will come out. They'll just wait this out though, surely. The Necrophos is going to be in massive trouble though, and he will end up falling. Faith Beyond still waiting with that RP in the tree line. Oh, he misses it. What? He wanted Emo and he didn't find it. And now they'll turn it. The Chaos Meteor comes down. Ego goes down. The Wolf is there as well. No Stone Gaze available again. Although, it's still no damage coming out to this Medusa. Oli trying to make a run for it. They're still chasing Medusa. Though Faith is on Doodle and will take him out. Emo, what can he do here for his team? They're trying to take down Why still on that on that Nyx Assassin. They were. Can he get a big Echo Slam off? They just want ASD. They're going to jump in. Stone Gaze is available. Now the RP, but the Echo comes in with the Cataclysm as well. It's a lot of damage coming out from Emo. And this Medusa does end up getting bursted down. The nice Curse Crown was there. Ego going to try and turn around with the Wukong's command. But can they do it? It looks like he can get the two supports, but it's still three down for the ping out comes, the ping comes with the tornado already there, now the terrorize as well. Faith Beyond needs a big RP, he'll find three of them, but the Cataclysm was already there, in fact there was a four man RP coming out. The Echo is there, but it's not good enough, not quite yet anyway. Now the Wukong's command, they'll burst down Dogfights and the Necrophos. The buyback's coming out immediately, and now Emo's been caught out. This is the big one, Dogfights is there with the Fisher, but it's not good enough. The BKB coming out, Ego, he'll find him.